and I'm good. One throw. I've had this down for 30 seconds, if that. Ugh. This is the kayak mic rig. I've literally had this down not even 30 seconds. If you can't tell, I don't have anything prepped. Do I, did I throw up this line? I just had a hit on my dragging rig over here, but to call it a dragging rig would be kind of insulting to dragging rigs. Not a big fish, I can just tell by the current. By how I'm pulling them up with the current. Panfish. So what I did was I uh, I put one suspended rig down with panfish. He can't help me in any tournament, so he's not getting the net. Actually, it doesn't matter. Uh, I'm, I'm forfeiting all my fish today because I'm forfeiting all my fish today because uh, if he pops off of the boat, that's fine. Because I'm using more than our four hooks and I don't cheat, so. I literally, I had my dragon baits out there for just a couple seconds. And I swore I got a hit on a dragon bait. But the current, the undertow is, the undertow is uh, too strong. So the undertow is, I mean, I guess I'm dragging the baits. We'll let it go. I'm, I'm dragging to the mouth of Tanner's Creek. And then once I'm done, I'm suspending to and dragging to. Once I'm done with this drag, then I will, uh, then I will check on the baits. Also, I'm dragging using the Sandy Drag, the Sandy Drifters. They are considerably bigger. Not a bad fish. They're considerably, considerably bigger and longer than uh, the ones that I have, and I have a double hook rig on both those dragging setups. The only problem with that is. Um, the only problem with that is my first hook can get caught by the drifting weight. I mean, extremely easily. So let's get this bait back down there. I hope that's a good sign. You never know. Maybe it was just right time, right place, or right place, right time, whatever you want to call it. Um, yeah, not literally not even 30 seconds after dropping all my all my poles down. Kind of micro scores. Now if I go, honey, let me go. Down the river on the Ohio Bury me deep in the water wide I'll see you on the other side If I go, honey, let me go Down the river on the Ohio Bury me deep in the water wide I'll see you on the other side Crap! As much as I'm complaining about this trip producing fish, I had this line casted again. Not even 30 seconds. I was messing around with one of my tangled lines. And I got a hit on this one. I'm literally pulling them against the current. I actually, never mind, I can submit fish to the regional because the regional doesn't have a hook limit. This guy is not getting the net because he's not big enough, in my opinion. But if he's close at 25 inch mark, he's good.
This is the nightmare I'm dealing with now. I can't tell the lines apart because of all this slime and I can't get the slime off. Uh, I just wanna, I just wanna scream. I just wanna scream. Note to self, pull the anchor up, barehanded. Cause you can dry your hands off and put your hands back in dry, dry gloves. Now my gloves are soaked and I don't know if that's actually going to do anything as far as keeping me cold. There's a spot here out of the wind. I'm going to go uh, hide in that spot because I just don't feel like dealing with the wind. GoPro, stop recording. P I mean, some people actually differentiate structure and cover, it, whatever. Stuff in the water. I understand the difference between the two, but not enough to care about talking about them differently. So, um. That has a hit. Oh, nice. I thought this line, so, I was just reeling this line in because I'm like, oh, it looks like it's not in the same spot. <laughs> this is a double hook rig. I, uh, I don't know how I feel about this hook set, so. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I got two suspended baits. <laughs> all right, so we're all sorts of weird right now. The current is going this way. Not so much where I'm at because I'm closer. I'm still in 20 feet of water. I'm on the Ohio River. I'm still in 20 feet of water this close. Um, I cast it up against whatever the hell this thing is, just in hopes for a stereotypical flathead. And he's, he's fighting like one, he's staying down. Uh, eh, he looked a little silver. I can't really tell yet. The reflection of the yellow, uh, or not yellow, white sky. Uh, channel cat. Alright, let's see here. He, If he's close to 25, he can help me in my regional month long. He can't help me in... He cannot help me in... Um, he can't help me in the national tournament because I'm using too many hooks. Uh, any fish I catch today, I won't submit to the national scene. However, if he's close to 25, he will be submitted to the... Uh-oh. I don't want to net. I'm trying to avoid netting these double hook rig guys. But he, uh, this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to hold the net underneath of him. Oh, I get him in the boat. In the water wide. I see you on the other side. I see you on the other side. All right, right here, I'm gonna put in white font right here. Kayak Mike 15 for 15% off at, cot, or at catfishclothing.com. All right, I might look a little ridiculous, but I um, I just checked the radar, it said no rain. There's a little bit of mist. Uh, but I actually, was it last night? No, it was two nights ago. Yeah, two nights ago, I actually tested this setup out right here with the light and the GoPro. And it worked really well. Um, I think I probably have the GoPro a little too high, but it's okay. It's better to have some... I think this direction is the best direction to film overall. So I think having this is uh, as corny as it might look. I think it's the best option. So I'm going to give the rivers calm down. I'm gonna give this 15 more minutes and then I'm gonna hop out and suspend drift down uh, down the main channel. Oh, this guy, literally right when I turned off my camera, started peeling drag. 
this is on a really big piece of the shad a really big piece of shad if he's hooked well oh my god this is a good fish all right i do have a suspended rod right here i'm probably gonna reel that in slowly oh, oh too bad this doesn't count towards the the muff long for you know i'm gonna put that back here Welcome to the world kayak fishing, baby. Oh, I need him on. I need him to come over here because I don't want him getting tangled in my other. Oh, man. Some people might say, figure it out later. Nah. And my anchor's right here. So I gotta remember that. This is a good fish. This is probably my biggest fish of the month. I, which isn't saying much, but. Man, he hit this and just was ripping drag. I literally just shut this off. I was just talking to this camera. And then all, the, I didn't even hit, feel him hit. He hit it so hard, I just heard. I heard my drag going. Uh-oh. 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 He is now... Okay, my anchors. Ugh. Uh-oh. That line, that casted line, that's no good. Let's tighten this up a little bit. The fun of rocking four rods, two casted, two suspended in a kayak. That's a good blue, I just saw him. Oh, 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 oh. He's wrapped in a line, no good, no good. Okay. He looks like he's hooked where he's supposed to be. Um, I'm just gonna slow play it now. I need to get I need to get him up here where I just This is a good fish. I don't think this is as big as the one Dan and I just caught, Daniel and I caught. But this is a good fish. A little bit more just a little more yes 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 this has a chance at oh my god for all the frustrations I had today this has a chance of being my uh, PB blue in the in a kayak oh. ha yes I just got a hit. Oh, my suspended bait's getting a hit. Double. Oh no. Oh wait, that cancer lines up back, okay. All right, this fish is uh, That fish is completely meaningless, and before my second hook gets wrapped in my eyelid, we're putting him back.
Oh. 